Hi guys, Brain the Scary Lion back with another video and today I want to do something that I've kind of done on my first video which was a couple of quizzes to help you get to know me a bit better but today I'm going to be focusing on three of my favourite things to watch so these quizzes are going to be on WWE, Supernatural and The Flash now I watch these shows constantly so hopefully I should do really well at these quizzes uh, so without further ado let's get into the first one now the first one is a WWE quiz what I've got to do is match the nickname to the wrestler uh, now I should be alright at this because like I say I watch wrestling all the time so let, let's get on to the first person the apex predator also known as Randy Orton where is he he is there there we go Randy Orton the apex predator first one bang three stars who is the lunatic fringe that is Dean Ambrose I love Dean Ambrose he's absolutely mental in the ring he's just got a great character so yeah my, one of my favorites by far next one we've got is the Funkasaurus now uh, he's no longer in WWE but that is Brotus Clay somebody call my mama baby yeah uh, the eighth wonder of the world that was China weren't it if I remember right no I was sure that was China weren't it I'm, I must be mistaken. It's going to be Beth Phoenix then, but am I wrong in think? Comment down below and let me know if I'm wrong with that. But I was sure that was China. So yeah, uh, Beth Phoenix. No, that was wrong. I don't see China on this list. I'm probably really. Oh yeah, I'm definitely wrong. Uh, <laughs> Andre the Giant, wow, yeah, yeah, that is horrible for a wrestling fan to get wrong, I am actually ashamed of myself, like, properly ashamed, the Demon of Death Valley, that is, well, the Demon is Kane, isn't it, so it's going to be Kane, no, it's the Undertaker, again, come on, Brian, sort your head out, you watch wrestling every bloody time it's shown. The Brain, that's Bobby the Brain Heenan. No, but there we go. We're back up. We, we can get back on track from here. We, we, I've cocked up, but I can definitely get back on track from here. The Cerebral Assassin, also known as The Game, aka Triple H or Hunter Hearst Helmsley. We got three stars there. The showstopper, Mr. WrestleMania himself, Shawn Michaels. We're getting back. We're back. Let's just keep it going. The Glamazon, Beth Phoenix, married to Edge. Yeah. Bang. The Iceman. Oh, no. Now we're off track again. The Iceman. I'm not sure. Uh, let's go with Dean Malenko because I'm. Like, I remember watching Dean Malenko, but I was never a massive fan, so I don't really remember much about him. Yeah, it was Dean Malenko. Uh, the man that gravity forgot. The UK's own Neville. He's a Geordie, isn't he? I, 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 weirdly enough, I love the Geordie accent. It's just brilliant. Three stars again. The man of 1004 holds. Uh, out of all of these, who's a submission specialist? Uh, I'm gonna try for Corey Graves. No, it's not Corey Graves. So Shelton, but not doing well on this one. It's, it's Chris Jericho. Really? You gonna go with that for Chris Jericho? He's got so many bloody nicknames, yet they go with that one. Yeah. I mean, I guess it's good because it threw me off, but yeah. 
the saviour of misbehaviour. Now that one is Corey Graves. You hear it like constantly uh, whenever they start the show. So yeah, three stars. Oh, what's happening here? Oh, right, we, we got it. Wow, way to go. You are the best. You got 90% on WWE superstars nicknames. 90%, so yeah. I, I wish I got 100. I should have got 100, but my brain kind of let me down. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. Now, the next one we've got is supernat the Supernatural Quiz. Uh, in this test, you'll find out how well you really know Supernatural. Now, uh, this is like my all-time favourite show. Like, there's nothing I love more than Supernatural. So, if I don't get 100%, this is a big failure for me. Like, a massive failure. So, yeah, the first question is, what is Sam most afraid of? Well, that one's an easy one, but let's go through the answers. We've got clowns, jokers, losing family, or planes slash flights. Well, the last one, that's Dean. He, he's afraid of flying. But, yeah, this one is clowns for Sam. On to the next question. What episode does Dean get sick with an illness? With an illness? Well, he, he gets... Is this from season one? Because all you're saying here is what episode does Dean get sick with an illness? Now, we're on to season 13 now. Yeah, season 13. So... You should actually put in what season this is from. Because it doesn't say in the description, does it? No, it just says, I'll test. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm not exactly sure what season they're going off here, so... Let's take a guess. It's, if it's from the first season, it's not episode 2, it's not episode 3, and it's not episode 4. Let's go with episode 9. Uh, what car does Sam and Dean own? Be specific. I want this car. Like, I, I just love the car. It, it, it's Dean's baby. Like, they say Sam and Dean own it. It's Dean's car. Sam's along for the ride. It's a 67 black Chevy Impala. Anyone who watches Supernatural has to know that. Why is it not on? Next question. Uh, what is the Winchester's home state? We've got Kansas, Washington, Boston, Missouri, or I don't know. I'm guessing the way that they're trying to throw off people is with the Missouri part. Because uh, they do know someone called Missouri. Uh, but yeah, it's Kansas. They're from Kansas. Who is Dean's so-called first love? Meg? I don't know. Sarah? Jessica? Or Cassie? Uh, this is the episode with the, with the possessed car. The racist car. Uh, and yeah, it's Cassie. Cassie was his first love. Who are they trying to save their father from? Bobby, Crowley, Jessica, Meg, or Cassie? Yeah, I'm guessing this is going off the first season. Uh, and it was actually Azazel they were uh, trying to save their father from. But yeah, uh, I'm guessing the answer is going to be Meg there. In what season and episode will a mask not come off? See, look, you can see here that they've, they've actually put the seasons in. See, I was thinking there that the quiz was based off just season one. But they've actually put the seasons in here, so what's going on? Uh, what season will the mask not come off? Ah, uh, ooh. The mask. Oh god, I'm I'm upset with myself. I can't. I honestly can't think. Season nine. We'll go with that. In what episode does Sam sneak off to Indiana alone? Croatoan, hunted, 
no exit, playthings, or night shifter. Oh, it's easy to go which episode did Sam sneak off, but to Indiana, uh, I'm going to go with the Croatoan, that's, I believe that's the one where, no, Croatoan's not that one, it'd be No Exit, that's the one where he's sent to the future, I believe. Is, is it that one, or is Cro, no, I'm going to go with No Exit and keep my fingers crossed. Who do y'all, y'all, think my top three favourite character, characters are in order? You can't throw that in. You honestly can't throw that in. That's, that's just not fair. I've got to guess what the person who made this quiz says their favourite characters are. How's this going to determine how well I know Supernatural? Oh, uh, well, they've got a picture of Cass on there, so I'm guessing Cass is the first one. And if we go for it, I'm, I'm going to say it's going to be Cass, Dean and Sam. Uh, we'll just need a guess on that, for God's sake. Where does Dean first meet Benny? At a bar, Blood Brother, Purgatory, at a hospital or in a hotel. He first meets Benny the Vampire in Purgatory. See, that one I know. But yeah, this... Supernatural, nice job. You correctly answered 7 out of 10 questions. I'm not too happy with that. But like, I, I, I should have done better, but one of those, honestly, just why? Did we get to see our results? Yeah. We got the clowns one right, obviously. It was 6. It's Yellow Fever. Oh, Yellow Fever, but that's season 3. Let's see. You need to put in what season it's from. Oh, wait. No, it's season four, sorry. Season four. What car does Sam and Dean own? Uh, yeah, we got that one right. Another one right. That one right. Right. We got the season that the mask will not come off. Uh, the answer was season 11. Uh, the answer was hunted for when Sam snuck off to Indiana. I, I actually guess which one they got right. Uh, which one was their favourite, so yeah. But yeah, not too bad. Uh, let's move on to the last one. Okay, so the last one that we're going to do is How well do you know The Flash? Again, I hope I know it pretty well. John Wesley Shipp plays Henry Allen in this version of The Flash. Who did he previously portray in the 1990s TV show. Uh, I remember seeing the poster for this, so I know that he, he, he played Barry Allen, he actually played The Flash in the original. In the comic books, is Harrison Wells a villain? Uh, in the comic books, uh, there was a Harrison Wells, but it wasn't, it was like a quick thing. I don't think, I, I think the answer for this is he's going to, is going to be he was never in the original comics yet no that, that's good then we got that right name all the secret identities of the flash in order of appearance is this based on the tv show or is it based on the comics it's the ah the quiz is how well do you know the flash tv show so that's going to be barry allen jay garrick wally west and bar allen actually Wally West appeared before Jay Garrick. Like, the actual Jay Garrick. But, it wasn't the it wasn't a flash at that point. We're gonna go with this and keep our fingers crossed. No. Well, Jay Garrick. Oh, they're going off the comic books, not the TV show. Well, when the quiz is, how well do you know the Flash TV show? See, I knew Jake Eric came first. This hat fell out of the wormhole. Who does it belong to? Jay Garrick, Cisco Ramon, Eobard Thorne, or Henry Allen? I'm going to say Jay Garrick. There's a spoiler in there. I'm not going to give it away. But yeah, I'm going to go with Jay Garrick on that one. Let's go question five. When the black hole opened in fast enough, four people in particular were Sean looking at it. Who were they? 
Captain Singh, Henry Allen, Golden Glider and Peekaboo, Hawk Girl, Captain Cold, Henry Allen and Captain Singh, or Killer Frost, Vibe, Firestorm and the Reverse Flash. Uh, oh, again, spoilers. I don't want to give too much away, but it can't be that one. Uh, I'm going to say it's the second one. Yeah, second one. Woo! Got stumped on that one there, even though I've seen the episode. In the comics, Caitlin Snow is which female villain? Killer Frost, Peekaboo, Golden Glider, or Captain Cold? I don't want to take too much time going through each of them, but it's Killer Frost. Cisco taking out the Pied Piper and telling him he's not the only one who understands vibrations. Two. Cisco remembering the alternate timeline from Out of Time. Three, Cisco creating a sonic canary cry device for Laurel. Which do these three scenarios have in common? They all include Cisco being awesome. They all foreshadow Cisco becoming the superhero vibe. Or they all involve Cisco. Um. I'm going to say they all foreshadow him becoming Vibe. Yeah. He, he's great as Vibe. Name the secret identity of the Bug-Eyed Bandit. Both are correct. Brie Larvin or Bertram Larvin is Brie Larvin. What? Oh, both both are correct. Uh, we, again, we're going the comics. Oh, it, it's based on a TV show. Stick to the TV show. How do you know if Captain Cold is going to start in an episode? If there is a word that has to do with ice in the title, if the word rogue is in the title, or if his actor is slated for the episode. It's if the word rogue is in the title. Yeah, love the, I love those episodes. Captain Cold is like the best villain. Uh, did the season finale lead up to flashpoints from the comics? Yes, because it featured the death of Eddie Thorne. No, Barry didn't save his mother, so he didn't jump start a new timeline. Yes, because Barry travelled back to the past. Uh, no, because Barry didn't save his mother. We got 8 out of 10, ha ha. Uh, yes, ha ha, you are the master. Thank God I did better on that one. But yeah, um, I'm going to end the video there. Uh, thanks for sticking around throughout all of that. Uh, if you did like the video, give it a like. Comment down below what you thought uh, or what you'd like to see in the future. Subscribe so that you can see more of my content. Hit the bell. And yeah, see you in the next one.